Now with Cut 2 still days away from delivering any pay dirt, the crew is eager to feed whatever they can into their wash plant. Jack digs up the access ramp to Cut 1. We might as well get as much gold out of this one as we can, so we can go to Cut number 2. Todd and Jim run the old access ramp dirt through the wash plant. Hey, Jim, last bucket. Yeah, we're going to shut down, take a look at these ripples. What do you think, Jim? Don't see much gold. There's some gold in there. Holy smokes, look at that thing. <laughs> oh, sweet. Oh, look at there. That's what I've been looking for ever since last year. Dude, look at the size of that bad boy. I think that's just awesome. I mean, Again, sweet. It, I think that's just the beginning. Oh, right there, that's our first Klondike nugget. They're nowhere it's a nice either. one. Guys, I hate to tell you this. I don't know if that's a Quartz Creek nugget. I think it might be Toronto? Yep. Really? I do. Toronto Creek runs into Quartz Creek on the south end of the Hoffman's claim. The nugget was pulled from the access ramp on the southern end of cut one. But the crew has been prepping their second cut further from Toronto Creek. Todd and Jack scout out Toronto Creek, where Todd suspects there's better gold. They discuss a possible change of plan. I know there's gold up Toronto. That gold worked his way out to the mouth, right here, somewhere in this I agree, area. I know. Right now, we're sitting on 40 ounces total. Half this cut on cut number two is done. There could be, who knows, 500 to 1,000 ounces right at the mouth here. Yeah, I know. We got time for one more cut. You're going to have to make a decision. I'm willing to work whatever way it goes. Toronto Creek just may be richer ground than cut two. But it'll take weeks to strip. The crew is a man down, and winter could freeze them out before they even reach pay gravel. All new Gold Rush, Friday at 9, only on Discovery.